The next big battle the United Opposition and the Bharatiya Janata Party BJP, will be locking their horns in as the position of Deputy Chairman of Rajya Sabha. PJ Kurian's term expires on 30 June and the monsoon session of Parliament, which commences mid-July, will witness a contest for the chair. The opposition is determined to not give the BJP a walkover and hence is already engaged in informal conversations for almost a month ahead of the elections to finalize a candidate. The current strength of the House stands at 245 but with four nominated members set to retire before the monsoon session of the Parliament at the time of elections, the strength will stand at 241. To win, any side will require 122 members supporting their choice of candidate. To put the BJP out of the game, the opposition, including the Congress, has decided that it has to be a consensus candidate. For this, the Congress, say sources, is willing to bow out of the race and support any candidate a united opposition is willing to nominate. The choice may boil down to a Biju Janata Dal, BJD, or Trinamool Congress, TMC, candidate. Currently, BJD has nine members in the upper house while the TMC has 13. BJD, being one of the fence-sitting parties, the United Opposition is willing to concede to a candidate from the Odisha-based party, to bag its support in the race. Efforts are underway to reach out to Naveen Patnaik and bring him on board. In the wake of the BJD's decisions earlier to support the NDA for President Ram Nath Kavand and opposition for Vice President Gopal Krishna Gandhi, their allegiance is a mystery. Meanwhile, there may be a problem finding a qualified candidate within the BJD for the position. That, however, isn't a problem with the TMC. Sources tell India Today, TMC MP Sukhandu Shikharoi's name is doing the rounds given his experience already as a member of the chairman's panel, who has officiated several times in the chair and hence has the requisite experience. The TMC though is willing to let go of the position if the BJD promises to extend support to the opposition. Two of the other fence-sitting parties are the Telangana Rashtra Samiti TRS, and the Yuvahana Shramika Rithu Congress Party YSRCP. Both parties have six and two members, respectively, in the Rajya Sabha. The opposition is hopeful the recent dialogue between TRS Chief K. Chandra Sakar Rao and TMC boss Mamata Banerjee will be able to break the ice in favor of the opposition. In the earlier contests though, both for President and Vice President, TRS had extended support to the NDA's candidates. It may be too premature at this stage to second-guess any side's strategy but it is undoubtedly expected to be a hotly contested battle that both sides will go to any lengths to win. The BJP, smarting from the recent losses in Karnataka in the Lok Sabha and Assembly by polls, will look to break the unity in the opposition, lest it acquire monster-like proportions ahead of 2019, also read, telling Ganaman sends PM Modi check for nine pays to protest fuel price hike.